we talked about, hey, we did not perform well up there. Uh, it was an embarrassing loss we felt. Uh, you know, you go through the season, you know, nobody goes into it expecting to go undefeated, but you don't want what, what we call a bad loss to a team that has a losing record. And that, not, nothing against young Harris. You know, I really respect Matt Steersman and the job he does and in their program, but uh, they haven't had a good year, and so that's that one blemish on the record. And we wanted to make sure that we performed a lot better one at home and two against the team that we didn't perform well at their place. And the emphasis was ball movement. And, uh, you know, they're going to sit in that zone. we got to keep the ball moving. we got to be in attack mode. And I was really proud of the effort moving the ball. And, uh, and it provided us a lot of opportunities for school. Uh, I mean, it was just fun to get out there and play hard because I know I've been shooting a little bit here and there, and I've just been waiting for him to finally fall. Um, but today they kind of hit him, and my teammates fed it to me. So we just kind of did ball movement as a team as well. I think it was twofold. I thought, yes, our offensive ball movement and people movement was much better. Uh, we were confident. We, we kept the floor space. We made the extra pass, which created a wide open shot. That also provided opportunities to go get offensive rebounds. Their zone was spread out. And then on the other end, the defensive end, we did a much better job defending their dribble drives than we did at their place. We kept them out of the paint for the most part. Uh, and for three quarters, we did it without fouling. Uh, we fouled in the fourth quarter. But, uh, but I was proud of the defense of Everett. Hold them to 49 was really big. It felt good to get some nice revenge on them. We all keep on saying, I wonder how we lost to them in the first place. But we had some good team chemistry out there this time, a little less sloppy, a little less turnovers. And just got the ball moving and had some good passes. And everything as a team worked out well. This is the first Saturday home game we've played in over a month. And, uh, and we're actually going to get to play two back-to-back uh, -back home games for the first time in over a month. And so we, we need a good day off tomorrow on Sunday. Come back in here and have good practices Monday and Tuesday, preparing for another home game Wednesday. We want to keep the streak alive, but we know we got three games left, and we expect to have to win all three to have a chance to win conference.